thank you for joining us. Our morning outlook will focus on the pound dollar, recent developments, and its potential impact on the markets. Let's hear from Greg in our trading room. The last session saw the pound fall 0.5% against the dollar. The MACD is giving a positive signal, going against our overall technical analysis. The Bitcoin dollar pair skyrocketed 2.7% in the last session. The Williams indicator is giving a negative signal. The oil dollar price remained largely unchanged in the last session. The ultimate oscillator is giving a negative signal, which matches our overall technical analysis. The last session saw the Aussie drop 0.6% against the dollar. The Williams indicator is giving a negative signal. Thank you for sharing with us. Now let's hear from our news department. First, there's huge price swings in the two largest cryptocurrencies, Bitcoin and Ethereum's Ether, prompted more than $400 million of open trades to get liquidated, the most since the August crash. European markets closed higher as momentum in markets picked up on the back of robust corporate earnings. On Wall Street, the S&P 500 hovered near the flat line as the broad market index struggled to build on its longest winning streak since November 2021. ExxonMobil Corp replaced Tesla as the most shorted large-cap stock in the S&P 500, according to a report from Hazeltree. Before last month, Elon Musk's car company had held the top spot as the most shorted stock for four consecutive months. Thank you, and now let's go through today's major economic events. The U.S. Michigan Consumer Sentiment Index will be released at 1500 hours GMT. The U.S. Baker Hughes U.S. Oil Rig Count at 1800 hours GMT. Finland's current account at 0600 hours GMT. Finland's industrial output will be released at 0600 hours GMT. The UK's gross domestic product at 0700 hours GMT. The UK's industrial production at 0700 hours GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to log in tomorrow morning with the latest news and events from the financial market.